Hi. Have any of you seen Zoe? Not since last night. After we looked at the stars, Mr. Bain gave her a ride home. You let her go off alone with him? Okay, she didn't meet me to walk to school this morning, and girls are going missing. You mean like that Gloria girl? I heard she eloped with some guy. I heard she was abducted by the Yakuza who harvested her organs. Tris, over here. Oh, where were you? Sorry about this morning. I came early to help Bane set up. There's like no reception out here. Okay, everybody, gather around. Getting close. Okay, ah, uh, science is about observation. But because we have biases, our results can become clouded. Today, we're going to identify and catalog everything we see. Okay, let's go. All through the forest, every quadrant, over here. I'm worried about you and Bane spending time together. We went stargazing as a group. He thinks I'm smart, chill. The teacher working hard to make you feel good about yourself, giving you after hours attention, trying to hang out alone, sound familiar. Just because one teacher got frisky with you, Tris, doesn't mean they're all bad. Whoa. I found bones. Big ones. Like, human-sized. No, 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 I recognize these. Deer bones. Our teacher is not interested in me like that. I'll prove it. His nose was pointier even pointier. I know it doesn't seem possible, but trust me. You're free to go, miss. Already? You only asked me like five questions. And we got our answers. They don't seem related to the missing girl. Maybe you didn't hear me. A weird guy offered me a ride. I took it all down. Don't you want every detail? I remember a lot. No, I'd like to say thank you for coming in. Right side, you can still make it to work. Yeah. Madam? I just really wanted to help Logan. You tried your best. Now you can free up your mind for trivia night. <laughs> Be sweet to finally bring home a victory for Team Frankston. Yeah, it's me. No, there's nothing new on the tip. My money's still on the new guy her parents said she was talking to. The one they called rude and irritating. Yeah. Look, I think if we find him, we find her. Another guy? Should I tell Logan? That his girl wasn't to someone else? Would you want to be told that? So everyone had different theories about what happened to Gloria, especially Maya. Poor Maya. So I've heard seriously that this place is haunted? It is. And that the ghost took Gloria or something. They did. So we can use the Ouija board to make the ghosts or whatever tell them that never happened? Yep. Should work. Hey, Ev, want to use the Ouija board? Come on, it'll be fun. What should we ask it? Are there any spirits with us today? Yes. <clears throat> um, okay. Uh, who are you, spirit? C. A. Know her? Yeah. She died in here. What? Did you take Gloria? No. See, Everett, we're fine. I know who. Are you doing this? No! It's Camilla or one of the others. Others? This used to be an insane asylum. I still can't believe they converted it into condos after all those people were basically tortured here. But nothing weird happens, right? Not really, except sometimes I hear strange voices in the night. And all of our nannies. 
disappear. Come on, you mean like they quit? But wait, Spirit, we're like safe in here, right? She says you are an EXT. What's wrong? What is that spell? You're an EXT. Oh my gosh. Well, I, uh, well, that's lunchtime, scientists. Now, if you eat outside, do so in your car. When lightning strikes, it will arc around the metal body, sparing you. Fascinating? Oh, well. Mr. Bain, can I ask you something? Yes, of course. An inquisitive mind like yours can ask me anything. Is there anything science can do for my tan lines? What are you doing? Well, wouldn't that look nicer if it was all one color? Uh, I, I suppose, if, if one liked aesthetic uniformity. Well, do you? Uh, here's what you do. You mix baking soda with water. Scrub with the mixture for two minutes. It will exfoliate the darker layers and blend the two together. Thanks, Mr. Bain. I knew you'd come through for me. I think it's best we don't spend any time alone together. What do you mean? I didn't want to prejudge you because of your reputation, but here we are. I think it's best for everyone if you no longer join the After Hours group. Jordan, um, the kids are in bed like you asked. Are you close? Actually, I'm making some magic in the studio tonight. I need you to stay a couple extra hours. Um, well, how many? Because I'm supposed to... You really to... want me to tell the band to pack it in? No, no, it's fine. It's cool. Um, I'll see you in a couple of hours. my shift early, I thought I'd come pick you up. Yeah, well, I can't come out anymore. Oh, so you want to have the date here. I see where you're No, at. you can't stay, OK? <laughs> I'm trying to be the perfect nanny so that Jordan will think I'm a hard worker and hire me to work at her studio. So then why'd you pull me in? I need you to check for ghosts. <laughs> uh, OK, um, checked, done. There's no such thing as ghosts. Please, Zig, just check. Humor me. <sighs> Fine. No ghosts here. <gasps> Still no ghosts. Nothing. See? Am I your hero? said we could kick it. I'm sorry. If I knew this project meant so many late nights, I never would have suggested it. No, it's good you did. It's a great idea, and it's going to help a lot of people. We're grabbing sushi. Do you want to come? Thanks, but it's date night. <laughs> OK. Today's s'mores-inspired frozen treat recipe comes from Samantha in New Jersey. 
This is one seriously sweet treat, but not as sweet as my sweetie. Happy three month anniversary, Logie. Hey, I had to go with the police. They don't think my thing is related to Gloria. I tried to get them to listen, yeah, but- Yeah, they're idiots. I mean, they still think she ran away. It's just it's stupid. Everything was perfect. Why would she do that? They think she was talking to another guy. Someone her parents didn't like. They think she's with him. No, Lori wouldn't do that to me. And I'm sorry, small fry. I... Look, if I'm being completely honest, yeah, maybe she was pulling away. I, I don't really know. It's all so confusing. You probably gotta go. You're not going for sushi? No, I'm just gonna get some work done. No, you shouldn't be alone tonight. You're coming with me. And your boyfriend? I don't really wanna be around people right now. Is that all I am to you? People? <laughs> There's that smile. Now, come on. Does that look like a torture chamber to you? Yeah. It's like you're supposed to be the one that says it just looks like a pantry. You are next. It's definitely getting louder. You are next. Oh, it's coming from down there. You are next. It's a toy. <laughs> oh, can you believe it? Uh, yes, because I told you there's no such thing as ghosts. As if you weren't scared too. For a second. It won't open. What's going on? Are you sure it's love? Pretty sure. 90%. Okay, because we need this. We're only down 500 points. Ugh. The most successful Beach Boys album isn't love sounds, it's pet sounds. Oh, yeah, and all the songs are called Woof Woof and Meow Meow Quack. Who has a pet duck? It's your team, man. I'm just a pinch hitter. Okay, guys, we're running out of time. It's love. Lock it in. Oh, do you have to go? Meet up with your friends? It's too bad. No, actually, I was just gonna go get another drink. You guys want anything? I can, I can buy my mango own smoothies, drinks, please. Hey, okay, got it. Why are you being so mean to him? Oh, to the handsome older guy you brought on our date? He's my friend, and his girlfriend is missing. Can you even imagine? What if it were me? I'll still have a chance for some alone time. I'll let you walk me home. The long way. Just play nice for me. Okay, but he better know who is the first actor to play the Joker on screen. That's Susan Romano. See, there is plenty of room on this team for three. <laughs> There's someone out there. Maybe it's the kids? It doesn't sound like them. Well, I hope they're okay. God, I'm the worst nanny ever. <gasps> So happy to see you. Are the kids okay? Yeah, everyone's fine. Maya, who's this? And what is he doing in my pantry? Oh, no, no, it's not like that. I thought I heard a noise and Zig popped over to say hi for like one minute. It won't happen again. It's just with Gloria being missing. And the fact that this place used to be an insane asylum. It used to be a pencil factory, insane asylum. Who told you that? <sighs> Whatever, I'm starving. We'll talk about this tomorrow. So this whole thing was a prank? What whole thing? How could you embarrass me like that in front of your mom? Because you make it so easy. The pressure was mounting. No one was safe. Not even me. No, please don't. Look, these cost a fortune, and I still have a few uses to ring out of them before Labor Day. Thanks to you, Mr. Bain banned me from the science group. So you don't have to hang out with a predator. MBD. He's not... He actually thinks I'm smart. And you know what? I kind of liked doing the extra credit stuff with Grace and the smart kids, but now... You have more time to hang out with me and figure out what we're gonna do for this vlog? That's it. You're jealous. Of what? Science? 
Okay, we, we partnered up with Hunter and Grace so you and I could have more time to hang out, remember? Hey, I'm just as surprised as you that Grace and I even have one thing in common. But it doesn't matter now because you wrecked it. I'll spare your precious pants. But don't talk to me for the rest of the summer. Okay, you don't mean that. Grace, Grace, um, take this. It's my half of today's assignment. You could have done that in class. I can't go back in, ever. Okay, now you're not making sense. I embarrassed myself with Bane. He thinks I was coming on to him. Why would he think that? Because I kind of was. Because everyone's got a type. No, it's not like that. I was just testing him because Tristan thought he was trying to perv on me. Just tell him what happened. He's a weird dude. He'll get it if you explain you were just being weird. I'll come with you if you want. You do that? I'd never last a whole summer without you. You're the only remotely bearable person in that class. <laughs> Thanks. I think. The sausage, right? God, I'm such a failure. No, no, it's all right. No one can stay mad at bacon. It's not the bacon. It's just failing at everything. Especially the job. I thought it was your dream job. It was turning into a nightmare. I mean, I can handle the small paychecks and Jordan changing the hours on the fly without any notice, but the kids, they just don't like me. Who cares if the kids like you? Dude. Look, children are like dogs. So let's start. You can play with them all you want, but if you don't show them you're in control when you're done playing with them, you just get anxious and eat your slippers. So what do I have to do? Be firm. Show them you're in charge. And they'll follow you forever. Like how Zig follows you around. Hey. Oh, I need your contact from that building supply company. To order lumber for the gardens. Boy, isn't this your favorite song? Meow Meow Quack? It's so beautiful. It gets me every time. Thanks. You two seem to really get along. Oh, it's pretty amazing. I'm smart, I'm fun to hang out you with. You should stop. Why? We're friends. Amazing friends. It's not like that. I have a boyfriend and he has a girlfriend who I'm sure is gonna be okay. Okay, monogamous relationships are just artificial constructs. If two humans like each other, a title isn't a wall that's gonna keep them apart. I'm not gonna stop hanging out with Logan just because you don't think guys and girls can be friends. They can be friends, just not if there are feelings. Hey. Oh, just wondering if you wanted me to walk you home. Um, wh why would I want that? What's Gloria missing and all? You shouldn't walk home alone. I'm sure I'll be okay. Come on, small fry. Don't make me worry about someone else I care about. Come here for a sec. So, things are gonna change around here, okay? Okay. Can I go back to watching Real Housewives now? Okay, but I'm serious. From now on, you two are gonna treat me better. Okay, you're going to be nice to me, you're going to listen, and no more pranks, okay? Okay, sure, whatever. Great, I'm glad we had this chat. Hey, I thought we said no more pranks. That wasn't me. Just stop it, okay? I'm not. Brit, is this you? What do we do? Just back out slowly and then bow down to your master because I got you guys. <laughs> Say hello to the bad guy. <laughs> I was so scared. Not me. Yeah, right. Okay, but can we agree now? Or even no more pranks? Okay, no more pranks. And you have to admit to me that that was awesome. Okay, it was mildly awesome, especially since it involved Zig. I think she finally likes me. Actually, I kind of think she likes me. <laughs> Everyone's gone. Everyone but Bane. Apologizing to him can't possibly be more embarrassing than when you actually flirted with him. Mm -hmm.
Uh, I thought you said he was in here. Maybe he's in his office. God. It's Gloria Chin. The missing girl? Why would he have that? Because Tristan was right. <laughs> Did you hear that? Tristan was right. But if they had only listened to me, what happened next could have been avoided.